Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we are going to be doing a really basic smoky brown eyeshadow look that really anyone can do. Please feel free to stop the video and just go at your own pace. Highly recommended that you do the eyes first and leave foundation, blush, bronzer, contour, whatever you want to do last. Okay, so let's get right into it. So the first thing that I've actually done is primed my eyes with a bit of concealer and it's just a light application over the upper eyelids and I have done a little bit of concealer under the eyes. I haven't set it with any translucent powder whatsoever and if you are curious to know what concealer I did use to prime the eyelids, it's the Revlon Color Awaken Stay In Place Concealer, the five in one. The first thing in prepping the smoky eye is using a brown eyeliner you can use black you can use whatever color you want really but i am using this brown liner because it's going to be a smoky brown shadow now i am just looking uh, down into a mirror and i'm getting my pencil and lining the upper waterline with the brown eyeliner and the reason we do this is to ensure that there's no gaps in the eyelash area it makes the eyes just pop a little bit more and just look a little bit more done so that's done now do a bit more of a i really like to dig the pencil right into the lashes there using the same pencil going over the lash line and you don't have to be perfect when you do this just as long as you Pretty much do the whole upper eyelash line with the pencil. And I like to take it right down to the corner of the eye. And then just holding my mirror up a little bit, lining the outer corner of the lower lash and just taking it to about three quarters of the way in. You can go right to the middle of the eye, but I like to, for my eye shape, is to just take it just before the middle part of the eye. Now, with a finger, I'm just running over that eyeliner just to smudge it out. And what this does is it pushes the eyeliner down into the lashes and again rubbing the finger not too hard just to soften and give you a bit of a smudge look i'm just going to do the other eye now now i'm just going in with a very light brown taupey shade here uh, this one here is the shade number two from the shantakai cougar palette and I'm just running the brush over the crease of the eye, window wipe motion. I've got to find a smaller brush now because we're going to be going a little bit deeper. And this is just a smaller brush. So I was using a thicker fluffy brush. This one is a smaller fluffy brush and I'm picking up this bronze shade right here, the shade number three from the Shantakai Kuga palette, and going just underneath where we applied that first shadow. Running the brush right underneath, exact same motion, window wipe motion across the eyelid. using the exact same brush and the exact same shadow plus this gray slate shadow on the end there. I'm dipping into both the bronze and shade number four. So this is shade number three, shade number four. I'm mixing them together and I am putting the brush right on the outer corner of my eye and I'm just doing little, got a little eyelash there. I'm just doing a little circle motion so it looks something like that 
instantly it elongates the eye and it gives you that smokier looking effect. Don't be too worried if you don't have a perfect line or anything like that. That's totally fine. It can be cleaned up with concealer and even using another lighter colored eyeshadow, you can blend that together so it looks a little bit more seamless. Even just using your finger can help to blend. I'm just gonna do the other eye now. Placing the brush right on the outer end of the eye and just doing little circular motions. Okay, there we go. I think that's looking pretty good. I think they're both looking quite even. Now I'm going in with the lighter color of the palette, which is a nude. And I'm placing that all over the middle part of the eye, blending it in with the outer corner of the eye. Now you can use a shimmer in the middle of the eye. For this tutorial, I'm leaving it shimmer free. I just wanted to have almost like a bare look in the middle of the eye. Hence the reason why I'm using this very pale nude shadow. With that same brush that we used last, I'm going in with a little bit of the nude shadow and the light taupe shade, just dipping in together and running the brush underneath the lower lash line to set that brown eyeliner that we had used earlier. Now it's okay that the eyeliner from the top lash has transferred down to the bottom. It just adds to the effect. We are going in with lashings and lashings and lashings of black mascara. So top and bottom lashes. Okay guys, so now we've finished the top and bottom lashes with mascara. Let's move on to the rest of the face. Okay, so I don't have any foundation on whatsoever. I'm going to be using a powder foundation by Natasha Denona. This one is the High Glam, yeah, the High Glam powder foundation. And it does come with its own little sponge. And I'm just dipping in and doing a coating of foundation. Going in with a bit of bronzer now, I'm just using the mini version of the Milk Makeup Baked Bronzer. And I'm blending that out with my fingers. Just going to contour the nose a bit with the bronzer. Using my fingers to blend. I'm going in with a dusting of the Rare Beauty. This one's been smashed, but I've managed to put it back together. This one's in the shade Happy. And on the apples of the cheek. going back in with my damp beauty sponge just to soften out the edges of that blush and just putting a little bit of that on the bridge of my nose now the final result is either going in with a nude or any color shade lipstick that you prefer today I'm going to be using a red lipstick this one's by flower beauty it's in the shade poppy pout and guys that completes today's smoky eyeshadow 
well, the basic smoky eyeshadow look that really anybody can do. As always, thank you to everyone who has recently subscribed to my channel. It means the world to me. I will see you all again in my next video. Have a lovely day or night wherever you are. Bye for now.